everybody, I'm Dee. And I'm Jay. And, and we, we are Paro DJ. DJ. We are ready to travel the globe once again from the comfort of our 1970s era couch. Aww. It's Munch Pack time. <laughs> now, I will point out the Munch Pack this month, it's got the plastic coating. I think the, we should be the, concerned about last month. Yeah, last month. Wasn't it last month where it was? It didn't have there it? There was nothing. I don't know. But it's sealed in plastic again. I haven't even cracked We're it. We're still yet. here, though. We are fine. You know what? Yeah. It was okay. <laughs> Let's get this booklet out of here. I don't want. I, I ain't no cheater. I'm not going to look at the book. No. All right. Let's let y'all have a take. To have a take. Let y'all take a peek at some treats. I'm guessing it's food. Yeah. I'm thinking there's food in there. Uh, you know, good stuff. Maybe some sweet stuff. Maybe some sour stuff. <laughs> Salty. Right. Let's find out. All right. I got. Mm, ooh, there might be a couple of biggie baggies in here. All right. This feels like the biggest baggiest thing in here. Oh, it is a big bag. Oh wow. We got. Truffles, y'all. We're getting <gasps> fancy. Ooh. Have you guys had, like, have I ever had real truffles? Focus camera. Uh, no, we've had, like, truffle fries. That's so, not real truffles. I uh, don't know. It's Probably just truffle not. oil. Torres Black Truffle. Um, I don't know what the deal is with truffles. Chips. Pigs well, dig them out of the ground. I mean, I get that. And they're real fancy. Expensive. Uh, you are in, uh, you're made in Spain. I was gonna say can't. Fabricado <laughs> in España. You were Have you guys ever had truffles? These are Spanish truffles. Like where they shave them on top of like pasta oh, or something. See, no, I think the closest we've had is, is, like I said, truffle oil, which is, you know, infused. In... I know, I've had stuff with truffle in the name, but. Yes. Oh, haha. <laughs> there was like a little, uh, pull tab <laughs> where you could have, but you know what? This is neater. This is more sure. efficient. All right, what is, ooh. It always smells very earthy. Ooh. Smells like the planet. Ooh, that sounds good. See if it we like, like your truffle fries. See if we enjoy eating the planet. <laughs> yeah. I think I will. Earthy or delicious? Mmm. Ooh, Ooh they're salty. Whoa, garlic or something punched me in the face. Maybe that's what it is. They are strong. No, they're good. But it's probably truffle because you know what? I don't know what the flavor of a truffle really is. Does it taste wow. like salt garlic? They're strong. It's really good. You don't need much truffle mm -mm. when you have truffle. Goes a long way. Potatoes, oil, salt, dehydrated truffle. Oh, and apparently truffle aroma is an ingredient. How do you? Okay, I'm not it even gonna really ask. really fresh. That's like, all that's in here. Good. So apparently, what we're tasting is truffle. So to me, it tasted like garlic. It Pe tastes like garlic. Yeah. There's no garlic. It doesn't say so. It tastes just like garlic salt. Hmm. I think there is. That's good though. I. They're really crispy. That might be the closest that I've come to tasting like an actual truffle. Potatoes come from the earth. Truffles come from the earth. Why is it such an addicting flavor? MSG. No, <laughs> not really. Okay. I don't know. It's expensive. You better put them down. We're gonna have to pay much pack extra if we eat them all. Mm, good. That was pretty good. Really salty, but good. All right, we'll see. This was the next little. Okay, that was the biggie baggie. So now here's a small baggie. Ooh, it says cookies. Or is it truffles? Watch, more truffles. It's a truffle box. <laughs> Dolcetto cookies and cream wafer bites. Cute. Well, those look delicious. Did I say 100 calories in the corner? Oh, yeah, 100 cal. It's a 100 calorie it's pack. Healthy. You know what? They knew. <laughs> uh, vanilla cream filled cookies. Oh, where are you from? Mm -hmm. uh, it's all English. Is it Italian? Dolcetto? Is that what it says? Dolcetto. Pepites. I would think Italian, but I don't know. Well, every word on here is English. Well, then I guess it's not. Uh, not that that's really saying anything. Let's look under all the flaps. It's distributed by um, California. That would be in America. Um, Last I checked, anyway. Oh, product of Indonesia. Oh, I think it's Italy. I was so excited. Indonesia. Huh. Well, that's cool. Pillow-shaped cookies, no high fructose corn syrup, no artificial ingredients, and no trans fat. That's why it's 100 calories. Oh, yeah. Come on now. Put some good stuff back in here. <laughs> I need the good stuff. Am I making a mess again? I am. Always. Ooh, it smells so they smell healthy. You know, I just love to smell it, and then they smell chocolatey. They smell dark. Is it like covered? They smell oh, rich. It's, like it's a, a pillow. Yeah. You just put your head on this and sleep at night. That's terrible. It's a okay. Here there she goes. There you go. Uh, it might. Mm, I don't know if that worked or not. Pretty, I can't keep moving. Yeah. Anyway, it looks like a pillow. <laughs> that's a very blurry pillow, but yes, it's a little um pillow. That's it's like an Oreo. Like a what? Like an Oreo. Oh, that's tasty. I still have truffle in my mouth. It's dark oh. chocolate. That's really good. Very Oreo-esque, I guess. It's got that dark... I can get down with that for 100 calories. Get down, girl. Go ahead, get down. Well, now I'm only getting like 25 calories, so... <laughs> Trying to save your life here. You know what I mean? Mmm. 
Those are really good. I opened it upside down so you can't hold the package up anymore. <laughs> Oops. I'm doing really well at package opening today. So if you eat like a bigger bag, is it still 100 calories? Yeah, that's <laughs> magically how it works. They increase the size of the bag, but there's only like 10 mm -hmm. inside of it. So. Oh, no. Yeah. Those are really tasty, guys. I like that. They're mm -hmm. kind of like Oreo. They're not like as in your face. Like Oreo, for some reason, has a... There's something magical about the Oreo cookie. When it crumbles in your mouth, it's all soft and stuff. I like think a, I like that better. Do you like it better than mm -hmm. an Oreo? It blasphemy. tastes like a darker chocolate. It's blasphemous. Yeah. All right, this is kind of wafery. Let's go for... Oh, it's Nutella. Didn't we have these before? Yeah. We've had Those are these. good, though. Nutella Breadsticks. <laughs> Nutella filled breadsticks. Yep, we have totally had these in a munch pack before. They're good. Let's remind ourselves where they're from. I don't think okay. we had a pack that big though. I think it was just one. You might be right. This, this is a double pack. a lot pack. larger. <laughs> this is a double pack. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm gonna say this looks, oh gosh, I can't even tell. It looks Greek actually. Well, where does Nutella come from? Greece? No, Italy? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> Am I right? Maybe. Maybe. My gosh, there's a lot of words on the back of this package. <laughs> Look at all these words. Don't panic. Does this tell me? It. Put it in. Oh. Ah. Maybe if you just make strange noises, you'll figure Ooh. out where it's from. Oh, I don't think oh it works it's like working that. so far. Oh, here we go. This looks good. Mm. Italy. Ferrero, right. Greece. Ah. That took a long time. My, is anything from Italy? No. no. Italy makes nothing. <laughs> you know what? I think pasta. Ferrero International. It's Greece. It says Greece. Uh, I'm gonna have to check the book to double Greece? check. But you were guessing, right? Did well, no, I saw the word Greece, uh, and all the lettering looked Greece. Greece is the word. That's what I've heard. It is. Oh, okay. And then you have, well, More you know what? They're stuck. But inside <laughs> of here, we have two, uh, which I believe we received one. one of these yeah. last time. So let unless we're just remembering wrong. No, I don't think so. All right, this is a Nutella. Here, I'll let you open this. I'm gonna check the book to make sure okay. it is Greece. I don't want to give the wrong country credit. You know what I mean? I don't want to see what else we're getting though. So let me. Uh, oh, it's from Poland. It's not Greece. Really? Nutella Buretti says it's from Poland. You would think as many times as we've had Nutella, we would remember this. Thing. Yeah, no, I don't. I don't. Oh, Did it's it? so cute. Ah, it's real cute. It's, it's like a like little a baguette. baguette. Which is why I thought it. Well, that would be French, but I'm like determined to. <laughs> that would be French. <laughs> I really want to find the word Poland on here, but... It's greasy. Too. Oh, Ferrero Polska. Okay. All right. I'll believe it. a little it. bit greasy, but there you go. Greasy is the word. Do I get <laughs> both of these? Yeah, I'm going to eat one. All right. I'm going to eat the middle. Mm, it looks a little scarce in there. I'm going to eat the middle one first. Oh, I have a lot of Nutella. Mm, it's a lot of Nutella. <laughs> this is the thrilling commentary you get while you chew on Nutella. It's a lot. Chocolatey. Hazelnutty. There's no way to eat that gracefully. You know what Nutella tastes like. The outside doesn't really taste like much. It's just a crunchy shell that's meant to deliver Nutella to your mouth hole. And it does its job like bread. well. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Not my favorite thing, but I don't really love Nutella. Sorry. <laughs> I guess the other one's for me then. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Poland. It's good. It's just. Uh, or lost. Greece, or Italy, or whoever. Whoever makes Nutella. Mm. I still think it's Italy. I don't think it is. All right, we have two. Let's see, do you want a heavy package or a light package? Heavy. All right. Oh gosh, what the <laughs> heck is going on here? Looks like SpongeBob. Let's see if we can get our focus going. I see Fritti, uh, Coco Smaracuja, <laughs> smoothie style. What in the world? I'm not quite sure yet. It's like they're eating ramen or something. Okay. Uh, this is uh, Germany. Germany? I would not have said that. All right. <laughs> What is happening on the package? All right, cocos I think means coconut. I like. I don't that. know what this word. I'm guessing this is like pina colada it looks or like passion fruit. That's passion fruit. Oh, is you're so smart fruit? looking at the pictures. It's a Look what's the fruit that's yellow with all this? It's passion fruit. Right? Yellow fruit. Crud. Crud fruit. That's correct. I'm just gonna <laughs> open this like no. this. I think it's passion. Fruit. What is even happening in here? Okay, is it so candy. I think so. Holy moly. We have like little, it's like almost like a pack of gum, a giant <laughs> pack of gum. You open it and you have layers. Would you like a piece? Would you like a, hunk of, a hunk of gum? It's as big as my hand. Yeah, I mean, it's a big, it's as big as my mouth. It's a mustache. That's why I'm going to eat it. We'll share this one. No, yeah, I can't eat the whole thing. Oh, it's very, that is passion fruit mm. colored. It looks good. I just saw the word cocos and I thought the mascot was a coconut, so I thought there was coconut involved. I think it's coconut and passion fruit. You know what? I think I'm right. How daring of you. <laughs> Where was this from? I already forgot. Good uh, job, me. Somewhere, Germany. Good job, somewhere Germany. Somewhere that didn't seem like it should be. 
Mmm. Too tropical for Germany. This looks saying. like a slice of cheese. <laughs> It really does. Does this not look like I've sliced a Ew. piece of cheese? All right, let's try to get you a piece that doesn't have much paper on it. Now that you've touched it all. Mm -hmm. Cool. It really looks like cheese. Tastes like cheese? No, it doesn't. Very fruity ah. and chewy, which you know I love. That's good. I'm assuming that's passion fruit. Let's read the English. Oh, you could have either gotten strawberry and raspberry or apple and currant or coconut and passion fruit. I was fruit. right at passion fruit. Though. And it is Germany. So coconut, passion fruit. Would you have thought Germany? <gasps> yes. Germany, coconut. It's so tropical Whenever I think of like, where in the world do I think of coconuts growing? It's Germany. Clearly. Yeah. Do you want another bite? Mm -hmm. oh. It's good. It's just stuck to my teeth. I like that it looks like cheese. <laughs> you would. <laughs> I'm still chewing it. I think we have one snack left. Those are sweet. Ooh. Every now and then back in the day we used to get a bonus snack, but they're pretty good at keeping us like, like, right to no. five these days. Whoa. Oh, wow. Alrighty. I don't know. Let's um, just look at the package because I don't think I'm really going to read any words. Nope. <laughs> nope. Those cool. Like duck feet? What am I looking at? No. I'm not <laughs> entirely sure. <laughs> I thought it looked like an um, egg with some chicken feet. I accidentally know. saw in the book where this one was from, which is why I don't like reading the book. It's from Japan. Japan. Because it's yeah. from Yaokin, which is from Japan. It looks like a corn stick. Um, okay. No. Well, you know what? You know how normally we can tell things are corn sticks? I'm pretty sure that Japan they are. pulled a fast one on us. Oh, this is a big corn stick. I can you tell me what flavor it is? Ooh. Before? No. <laughs> no, no. I'm, it, I was an intriguing ooh, not a disgusting. Let me try it first. No, because it you just smells lie sweet. To me. Here, just just bite it. Just it's gonna be oh, delicious. No, it smells like a. Don't it's gonna it. be. Mm, it's gonna be so I good. I was just gonna say this is one of my favorite boxes. Just until have now. it. Mm, just delicious. Just. Mm. It makes me feel gaggy. Gaggy. <laughs> <laughs> gaggy gaggy goo. That's a different vlog. Just try it. What? I'm gonna look up the I flavor. I want to know what it is. I'm first. gonna look up the flavor. Uh. Well, this says it's mozzarella and camembert, Ooh, so apparently like camembert. it is a cheese-flavored corn stick. Just a, just a little nibble. Is camembert, that's not a blue cheese, right? I don't know what camembert is, but you know what? I think I like it. It makes me think of like Roquefort, cam camembert. Can, can it you, tastes like a Cheeto, but a bad one. You can hardly camembert to eat it. It's not horrible. You like that? It tastes like a Cheeto. If I think of it as like a Cheeto. It kind of smells like a Cheeto. With weird cheese. It's not that bad. Mm -hmm. I just, I'm like, I don't, traumatized by these things at this point. It's like a sweet, Cheeto. puffy Cheeto. It's not bad. I mean, I okay. would take another bite. I am going to. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, that one's tolerable. That's not bad. I still don't love it. But it's okay. <laughs> Ringing endorsement. That's not bad. <laughs> They'll just be flying off the shelves, won't they? <laughs> Sorry. Mm. No, it's the best one I've probably had. Favorite corn stick? Mm-hmm. All right. But that is... Tricky, tricky people. The end of our munch pack. What's your favorite? Hmm. I'm torn between two. Are you? I mean, uh, Nutella's always okay, but I might actually give it to the the fruity candy. I kind of like the passion fruit chewy. You're torn between the tr wow truffle chips and these healthy Oreo knockoffs. <laughs> nice. We are They're just so doing good. the best at selling stuff today. Healthy Oreo knockoffs. They're tasty. <sighs> All right. Yeah, that was good. But that is it for another Munch Pack. So hopefully you did enjoy hanging out with us while we chewed on some food. Mm -hmm. If you haven't already, make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Become a Paromaniac today. Socialize all our media, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Yep. And until next time, rock, rock on. on.